Hi all, hope you've had a blessed day today. Today I'd like to talk about Hebrews chapter 12, verse 14. Pursue peace with all people and holiness without which no one will see the Lord. Holiness. Hmm. What does that mean? Well, it means saying no to the wrong things in life. It means asking for forgiveness when we trip up or make mistakes. It's when we put our own selfish desires on the side so that we can live according to God's plan for us and for the people around us. This isn't easy. It really isn't, especially in today's world. But as we walk along our path, as we go through this journey called life, we should make every effort to throw off the things that slow us down or trip us, right? We should learn to live according to God's commands and his desire for our way of life, for, his, for us to live in his way of life. Holiness gives us a chance to see God in our lives. It also gives us the opportunity to love our brothers and sisters in Christ the way Jesus loves us. As we grow closer to God, as we develop a close relationship with him, the way we interact with those around us changes. If our desire to obey God and live a life just like his, then we need to make every effort to be at peace with everyone around us. Because when we hold grudges and anger in our heart, then we can't possibly show the love of Jesus to people. Now, living at peace with people doesn't mean that we have to love everybody the same exact way. Or that we just turn a blind eye to misbehavior. But it does mean that we make every effort possible to generously offer reconciliation and forgiveness and take every action necessary to make peace. Think about your current relationships today, whether it be with a neighbor, a coworker, a friend. Are all your relationships at peace? Or is there someone that you hold a grudge with or some kind of anger? If there is someone like that, make an effort to make things right. Make an effort to live life that aligns with God's will so that others can see God working inside you and they will follow suit. God bless you all.